Hello again, thanks for watching. This is Joe Catrona with another quick tips video from Go Engineer. Today I want to look at how to eliminate the possibility of duplicate file names in an enterprise PDM vault. It's often the case that when, especially if you're using a part number for example, uh, for, the, for the file name of a drawing, uh, you don't want there to ever be duplicates. Uh, same, similar with uh, models in the vault, uh, an, an assembly or, or a part model. So let's take a look really quick how to do that. Okay, that's going to be a setting in our Enterprise PDM Administration tool. So I can be browsing my vault and I'm not going to find that setting in here. This is where I'm browsing the vault and I'm going to see that behavior in action. It will or will not allow me to have duplicates in the vault. Uh, however, in the Administration tool, and on any enterprise PDM client, we should have access to this EPDM administration tool. Start menu, SolidWorks Enterprise PDM administration. Now, of course, I am going to need to log in to the vault. Once I expand that down, that's logging in to manipulate the settings in the vault. Uh, I am going to need a user uh, name and password, the credentials for someone who has access to manipulate these settings. I can't just log in as a, as a, a low-level read-only user, for example, and expect to change this. So I'll go ahead and log in as admin with full permissions, and I see start to see the settings tree here. Now, for file types, uh, for for duplicate file name settings, we're going to look to the file types area. Okay, so I can expand this out, and we'll see a long list of all the file types that EPDM is aware of at this time, and I can manipulate file name, duplicate file name settings for those files individually. Now, what's probably more common, okay, on, on that same example, maybe I just want parts to never have duplicate file names. I would check that. But what's probably more common is that you don't even need to expand this out. You just right click on the file types settings themselves and there's a duplicate file name settings option from the right click menu. Okay, so I can say never allow duplicates in the vault period for any file type or uh, or allow them obviously or don't allow, this is what's really common to do is say SLDDRW and DWG. So for example, maybe I don't want file duplicates among these uh, file types. Never want a drawing to have the same uh, file name. So just a real quick easy uh, way to handle duplicates in your Enterprise PDM Vault. If you have any questions feel free to leave us a comment. If there's any videos you'd like to see in the future please leave us a comment for that as well. Thanks for watching. <laughs>